Hey, what's going on ladies? Ashley Brown here to deliver you another quick message on how to get a guy to call you more. Ladies, I totally get it. When you're starting to begin dating someone, you're into that honeymoon stage where you want to like talk to your um, guy all the time or your boyfriend or whoever, the, whoever this person may be. You want to talk to them all the time, but you don't want to come across so clingy and so needy, especially right away in the beginning of the relationship. So in this video, I'm going to give you a method of what you can do to get your boyfriend or the guy that you're dating to call you more often than he already does and get out of the routine of when he actually calls you. So you're probably wondering where this story is coming from. And for me, I can totally relate to this situation because I was dating a guy who I was loved, you know what I mean? Who I was like, okay, like I can't, I looked forward to his phone calls on a daily basis. But it got to the point where it became so routine when I knew he was going to call me at 5 p.m. Off bells when he got off work, I knew he was going to get into the car and call me. And that was the only time he ever called me. And I would literally sit there and wait, 4.59, okay, he's going to call me in one minute. 502 comes, bang, phone call. And it got to the point where I was telling my friends, like, hey, I really wish he would call me more than what he does. Like, the one phone call a day was just not cutting it for me. But I didn't want to come across that clingy, needy girl, like, why aren't you calling me? You should call me during your lunch break, this is that. So I decided to switch things up to see how a man will respond. And I guarantee, ladies, if you follow this method that I did, it will totally work for you as well. And that is, do not answer the phone when the guy calls you. If you guys are on a routine where he maybe call you around 7 p.m. every night, when he calls you at 7 p.m., don't pick up the phone. And ladies, I know, you're probably thinking, Ashley, but I want to talk to him. And I totally get that as well. But I guarantee you, if you don't pick up the phone, he'll call you again and again and again. So now you're probably thinking, okay, Ashley, so if he's calling me at 7 and I really want to talk to him, what can I do to keep myself occupied during that time? I highly recommend you call one of your other friends, go Facebook, go to the gym, go walk the dog, go cook dinner, do something to keep your mind preoccupied so that way you don't call him back. So after he calls you the first time, you don't answer, he'll probably call you again. Don't answer. Then on the third time, he'll probably call, maybe leave you a message. Then you can answer the phone. And when he, when you do answer the phone, I guarantee you the question will be like, well, where were you? Why aren't you answering my phone calls? Are you mad? And be as nice as pie as you can and be like, you know what, no, I was a little busy. I was cleaning or I was doing something, whatever you may have been doing. Or even if you weren't doing anything, make up something to make it seem like you were busy and you weren't just sitting there waiting for his phone call. I guarantee you, if you do this method for about two weeks, it will shift the direction of your relationship. And I'm not saying, ladies, ignore him all the time when he calls, but don't be so 100% readily available to every phone call that he calls you. I guarantee if you do this method, you will shift the relationship, the direction of your relationship, and I guarantee you, your boyfriend or the guy that you're dating will call you more. Ladies, let's make it a great day. Talk to you later.